Tell me about it. Tell you about what? My, my, my mask? Yeah. He killed my cousin, so I don't like him. Where is that that? <laughs> the sweatshirt says, not your respectable Negro. We won't pretend like we don't like hot sauce, and we won't pretend like we don't like chicken. We won't try and dress up in suits to make you comfortable, and so you'll talk to us, so you'll try and understand us. I went to this protest because it's cold, <laughs> but I'm wearing it on Thanksgiving because I have white family, and I want them to know that I'm not their respectable Negro. <laughs> The thought of anyone hurting my child, much less killing him, would destroy me. I was weeping last night, seeing Leslie McSpadden just wail. It's not my voice that really matters, but I want to at least show that I'm not afraid and that I, I want to be here and I'm not going to be silent anymore about it. I made this sign after the verdict. McCullen, he knew, he knew what was going on. It's just not right. Justice was not served. Some good friends of mine are cops and are good ones. And then we have some out there who take advantage of their shield. And those cops I do not respect. This is my brother. It could have been him. It could have been my three-year-old son. It could have been anybody in my family. Standing here holding my sign, it'll get my point across to somebody. From my yard, I can see the firehouse, the police station, I can see the National Guard. I hear the protesters chanting. This year, she decided that we needed a peace sign, so we made a peace sign. We were hoping that people would see it and think, hey, let's have some peace, you know? Maybe we should have it pointed down that way. <laughs>